Guys, what's going on? Welcome to Serial and Midnight. My name is Heath, and it's time for another What's in the Box. This this box comes courtesy of Ron, a.k.a. Captain Video, in the YouTube comments. Uh, Ron is a Patreon supporter. He is my friend. And uh, recently, I posted a, an audio commentary for Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves for the Patreon community. You can go to the Patreon page to get all the details about that. But the point is, I did a, a commentary for Robin Hood, Prince of Thieves, and... Uh, he listened to it and he sent me something Robin Hood Prince of Thieves related. I don't know what it is. He said it's like it's not a big deal, so it's not going to be like I don't think Kevin Costner is in this box. Uh, so I honestly have no idea what this is. I know there's a little bit of a thump to it, so I don't know. I don't know what that is. So I have my handy dandy Highlander letter opener here. Yeah, hey, this is this is easier than some of the other ones have been. This one's just kind of uh, spoke too soon. All right, all right, I'm in, guys. I'm in. Okay, we have here. Let's see. We have. Well, first, what the heck? It's a Robin Hood Prince of Thieves action figure. I'm going to open this very carefully. You guys, it is a boxed mint on package and it really is pretty mint you know there's a slight roll here so maybe near mint i don't know i don't care this is a boxed little john action figure from 1991 from kenner because i talked about it in the commentary um i have a bunch of these action figures from my actual childhood in fact hang on just a second so, uh, I had mentioned in the commentary that I still have all of my original Robin Hood Prince of Thieves action figures. Um, this is a, a tin from Oreo from 1996, which tells you how I was storing, storing my toys at the time. But you open it up, and uh, these are all my Robin Hood figures. So, I have my Kevin Costner. Uh, well, there's two because they had the Kevin Costner in one gear and then, you know, it was like crossbow Kevin Costner. I, I don't even remember all of this stuff. Um, here's my, here's my little John. He is like battered. He's got paint. Um, like look at his legs. He's got, he's got paint, uh, transfer, I guess on his legs. Sheriff of Nottingham. I had not one guard, <laughs> not two guards, but three guards because you needed Robin Hood to have had to have somebody to fight right and here's the Morgan Freeman figure as seen in the Azim figure as seen in my Robin Hood video and uh, last but not least is the Will Scarlet figure and then the accessories are all down here as well everyone still has their accessories I lost nothing but I do not have any of them still on card this is my first Robin Hood Prince of Thieves carded action figure this is the first one I've held in uh, 28 years, 27 and a half, 28 years. Um, I'm actually a little emotional right now, you guys. Um, that is really cool, Ron. Thank you. And he sent me this nice... Uh, postcard from Christopher Robin. It's got Tigger on it and it's got a nice handwritten note. It says, I hope you enjoy the Robin Hood figure and the other trinkets enclosed. There's more trinkets enclosed, you guys. Uh, he's really enjoying the Patreon exclusive. Keep up the good work. The figure is from his eBay store, Ron's Cool Stuff. Check it out. This is a shameless plug, but you know what? It's not shameless at all. Check out Ron's Cool Stuff on eBay. Uh, and it says, thanks again for what you do. Ron, thank you for what you do. Uh, thank you for this. This is... This is pretty incredible. Um, the only one that I never got is the Friar Tuck. And I don't know if he was like a chase figure or, you know, because sometimes they would, you know, be like one Friar Tuck, whatever, like one for every, you know, case or something like that. So I never got a Friar Tuck. I bet if I looked, I could find a Friar Tuck. But um, how about the fact that this is a carded Robin Hood Prince of Thieves action figure? in my hands after all this time oh you guys okay what else do we got in here we got we have we have a marvel collector's core thor this is looks like a thor ragnarok fidget spinner <laughs> it's got 
Uh, who do we have here? We have, uh, uh, you know what? I'm not going to attempt to name everybody because I don't remember all the characters' names. I do know that it's got the Hulk. The Hulk kind of sounded like I said Hawk. It's got the Jeff Goldblum guy. Uh, it's got, um, uh, what was uh, Kate Blanchett's, uh, by the way, I'm, I might be oversharing here, but Kate Blanchett's look in that movie was working for me. The the dark. Oh, this might get cut out. Um, so this is the first time I have ever held a fidget spinner. Let's see if I immediately feel relaxed. <sighs> yeah, I'm not even gonna finish the video. Who cares? It's just I'm so relaxed now. <laughs> and then there's also ah, oh, check this out. Thor Ragnarok magnets. And again, we've got uh, we've got Thor, we've got Hulk, we've Hella. That's it, Hella and Loki. Thor, I, lo I love Thor Ragnarok. I think it's my favorite of the Thor movies. I know it's divisive. I know that people are like, well, it's too much comedy. I actually really appreciated what Thor Ragnarok brought to the table. It felt very comic booky to me. Uh, they all do in their own way, but Thor Ragnarok, uh, I just had so much fun with that movie. So these are cool. Uh, given what I just said about Hela. Um, that one's probably going to go up in a prominent place in the house. Uh, <laughs> again, am I going to cut this? I don't know. So I want to give a shout out to Ron. Thank you for uh, giving me back a little piece of my childhood mint on card. This is incredible. Uh, and the other things too, the Thor Ragnarok stuff as well. Uh, thank you so much. And uh, guys, thank you for watching this video. I do appreciate you very much. So until next time, take care and I will catch you later.